was it uh was it a difficult uh process to give up drinking it actually was super easy it was super easy because it was just a mindset thing because again i i understood what and why i did it the reason i did it because it was a social thing the reason i did it is because i wanted to get away from me like i said you get a nail in the tire okay let me go grab a drink Oh, well, we didn't make enough money at the bar. We didn't make enough money today. Okay, let's go grab a drink. Damn, I'm, I am I just paid rent. Let me go grab it. Like you find all these different reasons to doing it. And then you find out, you say, okay, well, why was I, did I have fun while I was doing that? Then you start looking back and you start doing, you know, like look at the receipts. The only reason you did that was because, oh, it was her birthday. So I went out and I got drunk with her. Oh, the only reason I went there is because, you know what, I was feeling bad that day. Like, you start to thinking like, why, why did I even do this? And then again, not only that, you are literally giving money away <laughs> at that moment. So the more you start to think like, why would I do that? Why would I continuously give money away when I can keep this money, keep my sobriety or keep my focus, you know, cause again, all of it, all the drugs, everything is to help you lose focus. That's all it is. So you're not focused on what it is you got going on to numb whatever it is that you got going on it's all to lose focus so once you tap back in and say okay well i need to focus up you have to get rid of the things that make you unfocused you know whatever it is whether that's um women whether that's um you know hanging out with too many friends that's not going where you're going whether that's stop drinking every day whether that's stop smoking every day like those are the things that you have to really, you know, like I said, it has to be a mindset thing where you tell yourself, like, you have to look yourself in the mirror and say, man, what has been holding me back? Because nothing else is holding you back, you know, and alcohol makes you less ambitious. So if those things are all true, why are you not getting rid of the poison? You know what I'm saying? You want this cure. You want to feel good. You want um, to make your family proud. So why not get rid of those things that are not aligned with what you got going on? Of course, like I said, I say it like it's easy. Once you go through doing the back end work, it becomes easy because I did it and I, I, I didn't even like, oh, let's take a week and slow down. No, I, I saw January, I think it was like December 9th, I think. So it was right before the beginning of the year. And I just was like, no, let's shut it off. Let's just shut it off right now. We're gonna stop drinking. I don't care if you come over and you go, man, Shaba, I got free drink. You know, I've, I've done it before. I've had my fun. You know, when when we accomplish things, then we can celebrate in that sense. And even when we do accomplish things, we don't need to celebrate that way. You know, we can celebrate many different ways. There's so many different things to do. I love celebrating by having a good meal. It has to have nothing with alcohol involved. You know, I love celebrating by, you know, getting a new investment, buying a new camera, you know, something like that, where you, you know, you're, fo you're just so focused on what you're doing those distractions don't even matter. Got it. Amazingly put across. Um, going back to the um, video and photo shoot stuff,